championship tournament continues for the Bison volleyball team down in Omaha, North Dakota State facing the host school in the semifinals tonight after sweeping UND in the opening round. They now square off against Omaha with a trip to the title game on the line. The Bison jumping out to a 5-1 lead in the first set and they aren't slowing down. Omaha looking to attack from the outside, but the Bison front line holds strong. Allie Hinsey and Michelle Artis on the block there. The Bison lead 6-1. It's a six-point game now later in the first set. The first attack is blocked by the Mavs, but Hinsey comes flying up, launching this one to the back corner, putting the Bison up 12-5. North Coast State rolling in the opening set. Moving closer to the end of that opening frame now, Omaha with a deep shot into the back row. The sliding dip keeps this one alive and from there it's academic artists set up in the front row. The powerful kill adds to the Bison lead. They just need two more points. Now look at this dig by Logan O'Brien diving to the floor to keeping this one alive. Ali Barth taps it over for the kill. The Bison takes set one 25 to 16. But unfortunately, the next three sets would all belong to the Omaha Mavericks. The Mavs advancing to the Summit League Championship game with this three to one win. They play South Dakota in that title game. Ali Hensey led both teams in kills with 14 while Artis added 13. The Bison finished the year at 21 and 11 overall. The Bison basketball team is competing in a pair of different tournaments. The men's team is in New Mexico for the Lobo Classic. The Bison men falling to Northern Colorado despite an incredible night from Grant Nelson. Nelson finished with a career high 31 points. And the women's team began their stay in the Nugget Classic in Reno, Nevada. The Bison improving to 5-0 and so far this season with a 68-53 win over Boise State. Heaven Hamling dropped a season high 23 points to lead both teams in scoring. They look to keep their perfect start to the year alive on Sunday and they host Nevada. They against the host school, Nevada Wolfpack. North Dakota hockey team starting their home and home series with Bemidji State tonight. And before I can even get that sentence out, the Beavers open the scoring. Jacob Lewandowski knocks this one into the back of the net. The Beavers strike first. They're up two to nothing at the end of the first period with UND looking to respond in the second. Griffin Ness scoops up the loose puck and works his way into the net. North Dakota cutting that deficit in half. But they can't get too comfortable. Less than 30 seconds later, Leighton Road takes the feet across the crease, buries it. The Beavers respond in a big way, reclaiming the two-score lead. But the scoring party keeps going. UND on the breakaway here. The first shot is knocked out by the skate of goaltender Matias Scholl, but it's fired right back in by Jackson Blake. North Dakota battling back in the second period, now down by just one goal, and they would rally all the way back, tying this one up at three, and that score is going to stay all the way through regulation and overtime. This one goes into the books as a tie. It's the third time UND has tied a game this season. The series will now head west on Highway 2. They'll meet in the Ralph Engelstead Arena tomorrow night. Not a loss at the end of the and day. It hasn't been the start of the season they expect or that many fans are hoping for, but right. it it's is not on the road. Exactly. And they, they get to go to the friendly confines of the Ralph tomorrow against you know a, a team close to them. There's going to be a lot of emotions in the Ralph oh, tomorrow. Absolutely. <laughs> Thanks, Devin. After the break, Jim's back in with one more look.